everybody, I'm Forbes Riley, and welcome to ABC Family Movie Extra, brought to you by Sears. Now, I've got to say, this garage is really a mess. Oh, Forbes, Forbes, we can help. Oh, we're here to oh, help. We're here to help. Yes. Jane of all trades. Look, we have got Eden, Lori, and Heidi. Yes. Now, you guys have managed to transform this cluttered, stuffed garage into this. Yes. Now, so what are we going to do tonight? We're going to show you how we made that possible. Excellent. Well, you know, I've heard of Jack of all trades, but what is Jane of all trades? Well, it's just like it sounds. Basically, what it is is the Girlfriend's Guide to Home Improvement. We're here to show every woman can be Jane. I love that. All right, well, we've got lots of great tips how to organize your garage coming up. But first, we're going to send you off to tonight's movie. It's called Beautiful Girl. Oh, well, hi, everybody. Welcome back to ABC Family Movie Extra. All right, I've cleaned up the garage like the Jane suggested, but I have to tell you, it's really hard work. Forbes, what are you doing using this broom? Oh. You don't have to use old-fashioned brooms and mops anymore. Okay, Lori, what should I be using? Okay, this great Craftsman 5.0 wet-dry wall mount vac that I got at Sears. It's got this great 18-foot hose. You can clean the entire thing. I love this. Isn't this great? And you can use it for wet and for dry surfaces. All right, well, let's say you've just come back from the beach and my kids have got a whole bunch of sand and uh, shells and they went, oh, mom, oh, <laughs> all over the floor. Not a problem, Forbes. Look, sand is hard to pick up. Look, we've got these great attachments here you can use. See, I love the fact that they're also attached they're to the wall. They're mounted to the wall, because that way you don't lose them. You put this on here. Uh -huh. That's pretty impressive. So Totally sucks everything up. And you know those crevices in your car? This works perfectly for that. All right, I need one of these for the house. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so coming up next, we've got another Jane, or I think it's Heidi, yeah? Yes, Heidi's coming in. With lots more tips. If you want a great vacuum like this, visit a Sears store near you. And uh, we're gonna send you back to the movie. You guys are watching Beautiful Girl. Welcome back to ABC Family Movie Extra, brought to you by Sears. Now we have cleaned out the garage. I think we did a really good job. Did a great job. The floor looks great. Okay, what's next? Well, we're gonna seal the floor. If you've noticed, you've got some cracks. Ah, uh, yes, I do. Before we go ahead and, and seal it, we're gonna need to make sure we can make it look, look a lot more even. So here we've got our own crack seal. So what we're gonna do is come down to the cracks. Right. And literally, you're just gonna fill it in like that, okay? And wow. what's nice is it settles right in place. Mm -hmm. What you're gonna do is follow the, the directions on the back. And then also, uh, what I'm gonna have you do is once it's dry, we're gonna put a layer of paint, specifically epoxy. Okay, what is epoxy paint? Well, we have a little sample right here for you to take a look. And epoxy paint is a specific kind of paint which is gonna protect your floor better than most paints. You know how most cars, they leak oil? Most, most cements will actually absorb the oil and you can't get it out. Right. So this is a preventative measure. When you put this on, you'll be able to wipe up the oil without it actually absorbing into it. What's real important is that you follow the directions on the label and keep a great deal of ventilation because it can cause some issues if you don't. But otherwise, it makes the floor look beautiful. It's kind of like driving your car into a showroom when you come home. What a great tip. Yeah. All right, when we come back, we've got some great ideas on how to organize your garage because we're going to put the stuff back in now and uh, see how all that works out. Right, and we're gonna send you back to the movie. You're watching Beautiful Girl. Now I'm here with Eaton of Jane of All Trades, and we've been redoing our garage. Yes. But now that we've cleaned out the clutter and redid the cracks in the floor, all the stuff's gotta come back yep. in. And you know, as home improvement women, we're always looking for ways to either install or build something that'll simplify our lives, and again, like you said, the clutter. Even better than building something, we found this, the Suncast Sports storage rack that we got at Sears. Okay, this is spectacular. It is, it's so easy, and it's great for children because it's really accessible for them. They can just put it in, take it out, it's ready You know what's amazing, I mean, you have skateboards and tennis rackets, skates hanging, balls yep, up here, balls this is top. wonderful. Exactly, it's really easy to use. But even better, I have something else to show you as well. Let's go. Wow. And for something great to show you, this is a simple wall rack. Very easy to install, keeps all your garden equipment out of the way. What I love about this is you don't have to throw all these pieces of equipment into a closet where you don't see them, you never use them, where's the rake? It's all right here on display. Exactly, and more importantly, it keeps them safe so you don't step on them. But if you want any of the great organizational equipment that you've seen, visit a Sears store near you. We've got lots more work to do here in the garage, yes, so when we come back, but right now we're sending you off to watch Beautiful Girl. We're cleaning out our garage, and yes. Lori has got some more great organizational ideas. All the clutter, all the different things that you'd never have anywhere to put. Right. We got these great melamine cabinets that Look at have that. all these storage shelves, which I love because you can store all your tools out of sight, but yet when you need them, they're handy, and you know where to get them. Oh, absolutely. Can I tell you something else that's pretty amazing? Look what she did here. She has put 
rubber bands, screws, and all kinds of other little things that I just throw in a drawer into mason jars. Right, it's a great way to keep them separated and organized so when you go to grab something, you know exactly where it's going to be. And we've also got these storage bins. I love how you have different size bins. Now, this is a real big bin. Right, and this is, you know, the winter clothes that you don't need during the summer. Christmas time. ornaments. Christmas ornaments, yeah. exactly. All that stuff you can put in here, and it's nice and handy. Do you believe how organized all of that it's stuff is? And then you know what? All you do is just close the doors, yeah. and voila, it all goes away. But we're not going away for good. We're coming back right after this next piece of a beautiful girl. We'll see you in a bit. I'm here with Heidi from Jane of All Trades, and you guys have helped me reorganize the garage. And now we've decided to use it as a laundry room. Yeah, well, this had a lot of things that needed to be done. First of all, we needed a place to put all of your laundry detergents. So we put up a great shelf for laundry detergents. And then we put in this great washer and dryer. <laughs> this was an amazing addition. I know. This is the Kenmore Elite HE4T washer and dryer. Okay. When you look down here, they're both on pedals. This is optional. But it's great. You can actually put everything you need in here. I love the this pedestals. will make doing your laundry fun. <laughs> yes, actually, when you look at all the buttons on the washer, you I know. know exactly why. There's so many different cycles. My favorite one is actually the smart wash that actually moderates temperatures to help fight stains, as well as a skincare rinse. I've got real sensitive skin, yeah. and if it leaves any soap behind, I get kind of itchy. The skincare rinse rinses it a second time to make it really good for people like me. But look how advanced this is, and we're talking kid wear, we're talking hand wash. Bulky bedding, whitest white. And then there's also the dryer right here. Both of them are Energy Star ra rated. But actually, I've got a little treat in there for you. So I think you should reach in, in the and dryer. See you can find. Oh, am I gonna have to fold this? No, you won't have to fold it. Oh, look how cute! That is a Jane of All Trades T-shirt because I can be Jane. You can be Jane. Thank you so much. You're right, we're coming back in just a few minutes with some more great tips for your garage. But first, we're sending you back to the movie you're watching, uh, Beautiful Girl. Almost finished here in the yes, garage, finally. but Eden's got some great ideas when you actually can pull your car into this space. Exactly. Now, I don't know about you, Forbes, but have you ever come home late at night, you're a little bit tired, and you pull your car a little bit too far into the garage? I mean, and, I know it happens to the best of and us. And you don't know where your car ends and your garage begins. Yeah, a very inexpensive and very simple thing to do is just get a piece of rubber matting. Oh, and what do you Something do with it? Something simple like this, you can just get a simple spray adhesive, lay it down, so next time you roll your car in, your front tire hits the front of the mat, you know to stop. I tell you, this is a great idea. Great. All right, well. When we come back, we've got all three of Jane's joining us as we take a look at our finished garage. Right now, we're going to send you back to the movie. You guys are watching Beautiful Girl. Well, everybody, that's about all the time we've got here tonight on ABC Family Movie Extra, brought to you by Sears. I want to thank all our Jane of all trades. We've got Eden, Lori, and Heidi. Thank you so much. The garage is wonderful. Yeah, right. thank, thank you. you. We had a great time. It's been a lot of fun. And we figure with all their hard work that you put in, we're going to officially make you a Jane now, too. Yes. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Well, we'll be back next week with another memorable movie, one of my favorite. It's Top Gun. And we'll have some real Hollywood insiders to show us some great party planning tips, along with some great appliances that will save time in the kitchen so you can actually get to mingle with your guests. And don't forget to visit our website, abcfamily.com, for more information on the Janes. And be sure to visit a Sears for everything you need to organize your garage. All right, we're going to send you guys back to tonight's movie. You're watching Beautiful Girl. I'm Forbes Riley. They're the Janes. And I'll see you again next week. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.